What's going on everyone? I'm just making this quick video to show you guys what I personally do to track my alcohol. Let's go. Holy shit. Um, before I dive into it, obviously alcohol is not the best choice of using your calories, but we gotta be realistic. You gotta enjoy yourself. We all have like a birthday coming up. We all have special occasions, um, especially with New Year's tomorrow. So I'm gonna enjoy myself. I know I'm gonna have some alcoholic beverages. Is it the best? way to use my calories no but i'm also enjoying my way of living before i explain the method first off we got to know how many calories are in each micronutrient so when we look at protein one gram equals four calories when we look at carbs one gram equals four calories and when we look at one gram of fat that's nine calories so what i end up doing is making room for my carbs if i want to drink a bottle of soul i have to take the total amount of calories in this let's just use 100 for example so use 100 and I divide it by the amount of calories in one gram of carb. So I take that and divide it by four, and then that'll equal 25. So then I know that 25 carbs I have to take away from my total intake in order to have this. So that's the easiest way I found. You don't wanna be practicing this from taking away your protein because protein is really important, especially if you're running a program or if you're really focused on building muscle, you definitely don't wanna do, be doing that. That's the easiest way. Quickly Google what you're gonna be consuming for the day of, if it's vodka, anything like that, look it up, find out the total amount of calories and then divide it by the micronutrient you wanna take away from. So if it's fats, then yeah, you'll have to take 100 and divide it by nine. And then that number, you will have to subtract from your total fat intake. Another thing you could also do is macro budgeting. I explained this in my other YouTube video. So what you end up doing is take away calories leading up to the event. So I'll just use Christmas for example. I ended up taking away 25 carbs four days prior to the event, allowing me to have, what is it, 100 carbs extra on the day of. Um, so I'm still in a caloric deficit, but everything's more balanced out. And I find that the best way in order to keep on track. I am a 